It takes a being of Sutek's almost limitless power to destroy it. Your labor is abominated in every civilized world. And then you'll be the first of millions unless Sutek is stopped. Then I curse you, Sutek. In the name of all nature, you are a twisted abhorrence. Good morning. You've missed a bit. Oh yes, I can remember the audition for the role of me very well. Philip Hinchcliffe invited me into the office one day for a bit of a chat. He had seen me in Panto in Bogner the year before, and he'd been very impressed when I shredded the mind of Widow Twenky in a matinee performance. It wasn't actually part of the show. I was just bored. Anyway, to see if I was truly suitable for the part, Philip used to pile things up on his desk and set fire to them to see if I could hold back the flames with the power of my mind. All great fun. But we later found out we'd burnt something called Fury from the Deep. Philip and I also discussed various aspects of the script because I felt that the character, as written, came across a bit too evil. So I made some suggestions to brighten things up. I wanted to change one of the lines to, I bring Sutek's gift of jelly to all human life. Or, I bring Sutek's gift of ocelots to all human life. But it was all to no avail. Someone get Sutex straw. The filming of the story was tremendous fun. I basically just did this for a month and got paid for it. I didn't attend any of the location filming at Stargroves. Not that I was really bothered. I had plenty of fun in the studio all on my own. I suppose doing Doctor Who did typecast me, yes. The BBC had one or two other projects lined up for me, but they were just retreading the same ground. One was called Seek Sutek, where I'd hide in people's houses and then jump out shouting grrrr. That one only lasted for one episode, where I forgot myself for a minute and gave an elderly woman the old zzzz. And the other project was Sutex Swap Shop. That one ran for uh, one episode. A child in Glamorgan swapped a bunty annual for an Osiren war missile. You can probably guess the rest. So I thought I'd have a go at something else. I bring Sutek's gift of milk to all human life. That'll be 48 pence, please. And I always have plenty of work at Christmas. Plus, I've got all my hobbies to keep me occupied. Entomology. Abase yourself. Before me, you are nothing but an ant. You ant. I'm very interested in art. Can you tell what it is yet? And my pets. This is the real plaything of Sutek. 
His name's Neil. Neil. Neil before the might of Sutek. All in all, I can't complain. It was all great fun. I have no regrets. Well, except for maybe the little child and little Morgan. Actually, I think I've got some photographs of the filming, if you're interested. I'll just get them for you. Get off. He's always doing that. Sutek the Destroyer. Wherever I tread, I leave.